Today is my birthday and I really want to share it this evening with you, so please join me. Welcome to The Bold Encourager. I'm Rebecca. Thank you so much for joining me today. So today it's my birthday. It's Tuesday. Typically I film my podcast on a Wednesday, but I actually am going on a trip on Thursday. So this is going to be a shorter episode. I figured I'd make it a fun episode since it is my birthday. We are going to continue the Comparison Trap series. and We'll be back next week for that. But I figure today is my birthday, so let's have fun with it. And this is going to be a shorter episode so that I can prepare for the trip. Uh, we are going to Moab, Utah. <laughs> so if that is a question you're like, what are you doing? Where are you going? Well, me and my husband are going to Moab, Utah. We love to camp, but we also like to off-road. <laughs> and we haven't really been able to. A lot of things have happened in the past couple years. Uh, that would kind of made it tough for us to go off-roading. For the past couple years, we have gone camping here and there, but we have not really done as much off-roading. We really wanted to get our Jeeps in a place where they can off-road, but that takes time, that takes money, and, and thankfully my husband's a mechanic, so he can do that for us. <laughs> and so we're going to have a lot of fun, and I plan on taking my cameras there with me so that I can record uh, what we our little venture off-road adventure camping and whatever I can get on camera So hopefully these cameras don't give me any trouble <laughs> I'm gonna be taking my main camera and my GoPro camera so I can get different views And I'm just hoping they cooperate and nothing goes wrong with that <laughs> And I haven't gone off-roading in a long time. So this will be oh really interesting <laughs> but I'm excited because We've been wanting to go to Moab, Utah for a very long time. Uh, so I think this is going to be an awesome adventure. It's going to be a fun trip going to Moab, Utah. And I can't wait. I really am excited to come back and share with you all the things that happen. Hopefully, you know, I, my vehicle comes back in one piece. So pray, please pray for me. <laughs> I would love to come back in one piece with my vehicle, right? So, yeah, and Utah is the Moab Utah trails are pretty gnarly. So this is going to be a fun trip there and a fun experience, you know, cause I've done road off-roading trails, but nothing quite to this magnitude. So it's, it's going to be different for sure. And so, um, yeah, we're going to have a blast. Uh, we're really excited about it. So I figured I'd make this a fun episode telling you about what my birthday plans are, what things I really do like what you would like on your birthday, right? And so my favorite birthday cake of all time, well, cake in general of all time, is cheesecake. I love cheesecake. So I look, <laughs> even though I'm eating healthy and everything, that is my weakness. So if you put cheesecake in front of me, I probably won't be able to say no to you, just to be honest. And I do like carrot cake too a lot, but I can say no to carrot cake, but I can't say no to cheesecake, unfortunately. <laughs> Of a, yeah, carrot cake's really good too, but I like it when it has cheesecake frosting on it because that's what really gets me is the sweet cheesecake. I love that cheese flavor cut with the sweetness and that really makes me excited or happy. So one thing that I will say is I like savory with sweet. So I prefer not just sweet, but I like a little salt, like salted caramel. And then I think with cheesecake, because there's that cheese flavor to it, it cuts that that sweetness a little bit with that saltiness of the cream cheese. So I do like that combination. And so it's really fun. I really do like those desserts. I have been better about not eating so many desserts since I've lost so much weight. So this birthday was a little different, but I did have a cake at my friend's house this past weekend. So she, she, I had a friend that had invited a group of ladies together and we kind of did a really fun get together and spent some really great time together. Also, we we also had a little Bible study as well. So it was a fun event. It was mainly to, for the ladies, but also they'd like to, they wanted to do something nice for me too, because it was my birthday. So they did bring out a birthday cake and it was really sweet and it really blessed my heart. And the, this birthday has been great too, because I've been getting a lot of messages, text messages, social media messages. Thank just 
giving me birthday wishes. What a blessing that is because honestly, I, I'm just like, yeah, after 40, <laughs> it's not so fun anymore, right? So I'm actually, this is my 43rd birthday. Last year in comparison, 42, not very much different. You know, I think when I got to my 40th birthday, that was kind of a highlight, a stepping stone into, you know, oh, I'm in my 40s now. But I think that even though I know I'm in my 40s and I do feel a little bit older every, you know, every decade, I just feel like still I'm excited and joyous. I feel a lot of joy about life. Even when I've gone through things, hard times, it doesn't matter. Like every year I cherish. So I really do enjoy the fall season because the weather's great. It's not so hot. It's not so cold. And the turning of the leaves and transformation. So I feel like throughout the years I have transformed in such a great way. And I love... I love the fact that I'm surrounded by women that are amazing and such great friends and they truly bless me. They just pour into me and they give me so much wisdom and it honestly is just wonderful that I have a great mom and she's always been there and a really great example of a wonderful woman of God. I I, I can say I am blessed. Yeah. Things haven't always been easy, and I've told you about some of my struggles in different videos. But, you know, there's always something to be grateful for. There's always something to look back at and say, wow, Lord, you have truly blessed me. And so I know I'm, I'm actually doing a comparison thing here, but in a positive way, comparing the years of my life and looking at the greatness of God and how he has blessed me so immensely throughout the years, I can't say enough. And so even though this is a short video, I just wanted to, to share these, these words with you. And also, I just wanted to thank you for being here and being so good to me and watching these videos and supporting this channel. I can't thank you enough. Uh, when I first started this channel, I was really small and I know I've kind of slowly grown, but... It, it didn't matter to me because there have been so many people that have come along, been loyal, done life with me. And you guys, I really thank you for being so supportive. You are a gift and a blessing to me. And I can't thank you enough. I am a sentimental kind of girl. <laughs> and I just appreciate people and friendships and family and friends. I just am a grateful person um, because I know what it is to lose, but I also know what it is to gain. So with the losses, you can also say, wow, I may have lost a lot here and there, but I have gained so much more. And that's the gift that God gives us. So here I am at 43, excited for what's next. I know that Many adventures are coming, and I hope you continue to do adventures with me. Please comment down below. Please like, subscribe, whatever you can do. It really helps out this channel. And just know that I truly love and appreciate you, all of you, for being there. And I love you all, and I appreciate everything you do. So I hope you all have an amazing week, amazing weekend, and I am looking forward to sharing my adventures that I have in Utah with you as well. Well, I hope you have an amazing day, and I hope you stay encouraged.